What's up guys and welcome to Web Predication's daily tech tips. It's quarantine time, but the tech tips never stop. And so today's video is how to record the screen on your iPhone. So whether you just want to capture something or make a short tutorial, the iPhone lets you record your screen as long as you have iOS 11 and later versions installed. Now, normally you'll find the record button in the control center when you swipe down from the right in your iPhone 10 or later versions. Or when you scroll up from the bottom of the screen in early iterations of the iPhone, that's iPhone 7, iPhone 8, all those old iPhones that have at least iOS 11. If you can't see the record button in the control center, then you need to add it there. And you can do that by going to settings and then go to control center and then go to customize and then look for screen recording and tap on this plus icon on the left hand side to include it in the control center. When you do that, every time you open the control center, the record icon is going to be there. So now to record your screen, tap on the record button and it starts to record on the count of three. And it records all your actions and swipes and gestures and literally everything happening on your screen. It even records the in-app sounds. So if you're recording a YouTube video or a video in WhatsApp stories or something like that, it's going to capture the sound of that particular video as well. And when you finish recording, simply tap on the red counter in the top left side of your screen and stop recording. And that video will be saved in the Photos app or in your gallery. From there, you can edit and share and do whatever you want to do with that recording. Now, if you're making a tutorial and you need to record your voice and probably other ambient sounds, then you can turn on the microphone by 3D touching the record button just like that. And then turn on the microphone by tapping on that microphone icon right there. And now when you record your screen, you can also record your voice and other surrounding ambient sounds at the same time. This is perfect for sending up navigation instructions and making tutorials. Now for every video you record, iOS gives you a chance to edit. You can crop out the beginning and the end of the videos, try and make it a bit more professional. You can even shrink the size of the video and remove sections of the video that you don't want to be seen, just like you will crop an image and things like that. And you can now save either that video or save it as a new video and use it the way you want it. So that's how to record your screen on your iPhone. Thanks for watching. You can leave your comments and questions down in the comment section below the video. Don't forget to share and subscribe for more tips. Until the next one, my name is Chris. Stay safe, stay home, and talk to you guys in the next one.